Turbo Championship Edition. Ahoy everyone and welcome aboard, I'll be your Captain Linear today along with... Fearsome First Mr. Kier at your service! And welcome back to Guacamele Super Turbo Champion This Means Nothing <laughs> Edition. Where last time, well, we were forced to go through the Grand Temple. Uh, 
because yeah, we couldn't. We did come to us a soft point of no return since we couldn't fly out of the temple anymore. But we did get to an Olmak from which we, well, which 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 which, which we could uh, escape and go find the orbs like the statue over there on the right is holding, which unlock the true ending. And we have five of them. There are seven. Uh, let me do this. We have. Uh, let's see. Yeah, five of six. Uh, we can find one more, but that will not complete the mask because there is one more at the very end of the game. Now, this is a little bit different than where we left off because the next area where we can find one of the orbs is actually down there. Which is not actually an area we really get sent to through the storyline. So, let's... <clears throat> Let's just grab the cash over here and get down here. Oh, that, that, that's a little coin. Uh, yeah, we can probably get an upgrade or two now again. Here we go. Well, hello there. You must be wondering what I'm doing in this Grano <laughs> Snaking Cave. Well, I just happen to be looking for an adventurous looking some uh, the adventuresome person looking person like yourself. Yeah, we definitely look like we <laughs> are very brave going around in this costume. And hello, Glacier Boy. Hello, Glacier Boy. Yeah, I, sh I should put a background to the chat again sometimes because some colors and names just fade out. <clears throat> oh, and then again, I also... into the background. <laughs> yeah. Then again, I really should get to just commissioning someone to do a background, uh, to make backgrounds for all of these scenes. Let's see. I have a business proposition for you, Luchador. See this old, see this mysterious old door? Nobody really knows where it leads, but something terrible must have happened there. It looks like the door to one of the hidden realms of Chakmul, but those were ancient places of mystical power. Who could have caused such damage to such a place? Okay, so this is where we would have found out uh, the exp explanation about the the area where we find the wars. Let's. See. Uh, why are you playing as a walking banana? This isn't Fortnite. He's just as a chicken. <laughs> and what's that smoky smell? I don't think it's just a guano. Anyway, who knows, right? There's probably some cool uh, stuff going on down there. But to break through such magical rubble, you would certainly need some... Uh, dinamita... <laughs> Expectral? It's a magical explosive, quite well. It's literally ghost dynamite, it translates to, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> uh, yeah, I will have to be careful of Colonel Sanders. Oh dear. Me? Oh, well, yes, I have a stick right here. But I'm not the sort to venture into these kinds of places myself, so... What do you say, Luchador? Want to buy my Dinamita Spectral and find out what lies through your yon ancient gates? Okay, 100 is really cheap for us, at least. Pleasure doing business with you. Please, you do your honors. What? Nothing happened. Weird. Honestly, I haven't used magical explosive before. Maybe you did it wrong. And again, it, this is now open. Yeah, El Infer. Oh. oh. Wait, we're already... Oh no, the place is wrecked. <laughs> Hello. Did someone accidentally drill into here? It looks like it. Also, <laughs> we're dressed as, as a chicken and we're going right into the fryer ourselves willingly now. Less of a fryer and more into the grill. Yeah, or rather hell. <laughs> Because I'm pretty sure that translates to the Inferno, and someone really wanted to dig out of here with all of these machines. Yeah. Also, why do I, I, I'm getting the Nether feeling here? Yeah, because the Nether is basically Minecraft hell. Uh, the the other part, the math of the party with Rakir. And yeah, we have we have ended <laughs> KFC. Hello. <laughs> Oh, a luchador? How do you get down here? Someone checked your papers. A huge hole in a wall. 
Right. <sighs> you can thank Alaka for that. Well, you are now in Inferno now. Inferno now. El Diablo once kept this place running very smoothly, but since Kalaka's uprising, he's missing, and it's pandemonium down here. So yeah, he, he literally dug his way out of hell. Hell is a physical place in this world. Holy. And yeah, if we try to switch to the living worlds, we just get zapped right back in. El Diablo used to run this place from atop that huge tower back there. I've never seen above the third floor, but I heard he has a very he has a really sweet office. Oh, well, we stole one of his suits, so it, I presume from from that it would be a sweet place. This place is so disorderly since Kalaka teamed up with that sorceress and escaped. Say what you will about El Diablo, but he kept things predictable. Torture kind of sucked, though. <laughs> Good point. Really? <laughs> I don't think I need to say anything more. They say Kalaka raised his army from spare bones laying around, so the skeletons kind of invading the world are puppets, not people. If he had, and even if he hadn't destroyed our bookkeeping system, that would have thrown the sentence completely out of whack. But did he give one thought to the bait into the hassle he was causing? Not very really likely. Selfish, right? Yeah, and I, I, I'm guessing the devil here is a some of more orderly chaos, in a way. Yeah. They cause chaos, but they will put it where it's needed. Let's see. So the demon doesn't like that it's chaotic. No, that's a paradox. The, the, the yeah. Devils tend to be lawful evil, so chaos and, isn't really that yeah. thing. I was just to say, uh, he, he, it does strike me kind of like a lawful evil. Yeah. Like. He's evil, but he will use rules against you. And what the heck happened with the numbers? Well, they very obviously couldn't have it be 666, so they had it 669. Totally not actually 666. <laughs> it's crazy around here these days. I'm pretty sure I saw a rooster run by earlier. Maybe it's like someone's pets. You didn't see us running by. That's for certain. <laughs> yeah, how do you think I stay so lean? The ball and chain is actually a pretty good workout. Um. Let's see. I think it's actually pretty fitting if we do uh, the suit now. And... Uh, oh. Good boy, what to say? Also, what does respawn boost do? To reduce the weight before a player can respawn only co-op mode. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Let's see, let's upgrade the suplex and dust boots. And yeah, yeah. Lawful evil. The giant law firm made that apparent. Yeah. <laughs> Kalaga does not have the proper permits to be raising an undead army down here. If El Diablo was still here, he would be losing it. Could say he would be squawking like a chicken about it. Casa del Dia. Blast it. Button. Open this door. I have work to do. <laughs> oh, there he is, squawking like a chicken. Oh, Luchador. I was just examining his elevator. My elevator, which is broken, to my office, which is filled with very important documents. I've just returned from my little hiatus in the world above, and I'm noticing some tiny changes Kalaka has made around you. Tiny. For example, he seems to have rigged these, door as lock uh, these doors as locks uh, <clears throat> up to some sort of arbitrary achievement system involving all the old torture chamber here rooms upstairs. I don't know if he did this to train his soldiers or <laughs> as a sick joke or what, but I can't do much about it in my current form. You know, it's funny to see you here, Luchador. Quite a coincidence, really. After I help you out of such a difficult predicament up, uh, <clears throat> up in the desert, suddenly you arrive in Elfiano, all muscular and able-bodied. Seems almost like fate, huh? Like fate, right? But... Well, why don't you just head on up to the torture universe and let me know how it goes. In the meantime, he's going to try and change the packing order of this place. 
come on. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see here. From Vegetable. B Bo Vegetable Boy. Hang on a moment. Why does the pesos have dollar signs before the number? A decent point, R but it's more, you know. It's a more it's a more known symbol than whatever symbols that would be on pesos actually. Yeah, I don't know how pesos is supposed to look. Oh. Uh, yeah. The orb is hidden behind these, uh, really? <laughs> For tens of a second. Okay, I, I'm pretty sure we only have to get, like, uh, hmm. Yeah, I don't actually know. I think it said, like, we need to get either, either we have to get silver medals in ten of these, uh, or so, or we might need to get gold. Simple enough. Good. And that's messed it up there. I jumped too early. Oh, oh, there is actually... Okay, nice that it has a quick restart button. I'll try to go for my immersion. <laughs> I'll try to go for silver. If we need gold in each, then we'll just come back. Let's see. Defeat all of the enemies, get the highest combo. Okay. Let's see. Okay, so just do not get hit. Like that. Okay, we need a combo of 200. Bones, those thrown bones are going to be a real annoyance, but I'm pretty sure we can't make it already. But yeah, we'll see. Yeah, Back we, here, we, you. You are over silver at least. What? What hit me there? I think it was a bone. Yeah, that was an attack. Okay, didn't see that one for the swiping. Yeah, at the very least we're insured silver. And I hope that is all we need to get access to everything. Let's see. It shouldn't be too possible as long as we just keep an eye out on the enemies. Let's see. Use the environment to defeat these invincible enemies. Okay. And time limits. Invincible or invisible? Okay, you can only kill them with the spikes. Okay, knowing that we have to keep turning them on. There we go. Oh. Yep. <laughs> it was actually easier than... Well I was done. another room. 
It's uh, challenge four. That's Every time dodges to get through the thorns. Okay. Yep. Just give up, really. And it's. Oh, moving thorns. Okay, I, I, they just kick us after. But it's still counted. Yep. <laughs> there we go. Now, you have anything to say? A rooster came by and started clucking and flapping at me earlier. I had to physically shoo it away to get back to work. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello. Okay, more rooms. Challenge 5. Survive the waves of enemies as long as you can. Okay. Too many enemies pile up on the bridge, it will collapse. Okay, so we can't just dodge around. We oh. do need to kick their asses. We need to survive oh. for about two minutes. Does it say how many... ...we can have at the moment? Oh, no, you're freaking... Guessing that the pillars on the side are supposed to tell if there's too many or not. But no, they they just keep flashing. Mm, see, hang on, is the devil a rooster? That, that's what I get to do. So yes, it is true. Yeah. It Bacon. The devil got turned into a rooster. Yeah, he got too cocky, so Kalaka turned to me to where, well, I don't need to finish that line. <laughs> but yeah, he, bas he basically, uh, he basically got dared to do a challenge. Uh, this fucking plant is getting in the way. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, basically he got uh, in chat. Uh, actually, I th think we're almost there. A little bit longer. Got to clean up. But yeah, he, he got tricked. Uh, and actually, I think we're at... Yes, we're, we are at enough time. Okay. So, there we go. I was about to say we could let ourselves die now, but then bang. Ooh. Well uh, but, uh, yeah. Uh, the big bad of this game, Kalaka, this uh, smiley guy, basically he managed to trick the devil with the help of a sorceress who was crushing on him. And uh, yeah, they turned him into a rooster. Why well, he didn't just kill him and make uh, Infernal KFC? That's, well, he's a, he's a bit of an idiot. Let's see. dodge the enemies. Defeat enemies without dodging. Okay. Hmm. Oh. That's going to be trickier. Let's Is that see. kind of bad with this outfit? And could be worse. Just gotta, well, be a lot more careful in our approach. Yeah, to avoid the too many hits, like keep it within the the life drain area. And then of course these assholes show up. Yeah, they are going to be the biggest problem. Above silver. Yeah, and 
it, hopefully it is just silver that we need to unlock everything for the last orb. for the last orb that we can collect. Okay. If not, then we'll just have to go through again and be a lot more careful. That's number seven. Yeah. Jump between the moving platforms and get to the end as fast as possible. Okay. Why was there a potion? Why was there a picture of a watermelon? Stay sharp, really. Hmm. And also, I tried something new today. Oh? I bought some... Uh, uh, internet right tried now, actually. Sausages with bacon and cheese in. Yeah, okay. Tastes, tastes really good. Uh, my father likes those kinds of... Um, uh, rather sausages with cheese in them. I'm yep. personally not too fond of them. Yep. Really, again. <laughs> Less than a second short. Half a second even. But yeah, they, I find them really good. Usually I just have the sausage, uh, cheese around sausage. But this is good too. Okay, so get a combo without using special moves. I hope the grappling still counts then. And immediately they started with those jackasses, huh? <laughs> and yeah, it seems that we can just use the wrestling moves. And... But we can dodge again. Really? You bring these things in? Actually... We can't... We can't use the goat. Actually, can we use... We can't... Okay, we can't use them at all. I look... I was thinking we can't... It's going to... Yeah, reset everything if we try to use one of the special moves, but no, they're just playing disabled. Uh, just having us fight these things without special moves, that's just plain evil. Yeah. Not impossible, but it is really annoying. Ooh. And why is the counter not going up? Uh, because we haven't hit, we haven't surpassed 35 yet. Well, we got a bronze. You yeah, have to do that again. Uh, in a poor way, anyway, I hope the bronze is will technically be enough. Uh, I think it said we need it. At where I looked it up, I think it said we do need at least silver or something. Oh. Oh dear. Okay. That's our silver guarantee. And... Uh, okay. At least we got silver. If we are going to need uh, gold on everything, I'll probably just off-screen everything. Uh, if, because we are... I don't think we'll have enough time to find gold everything on this in the two hours that we have, and I do want to get on with the game. Not yeah. just trials. So, um, uh, we, we, we aren't we trying to get the final thing for the good ending? Yeah. That's oh dear. There are four animals and luchadors wandering through my workplace, and I have no idea who to complain to about this. No, uh, but yeah, if if it does take too long to get all the silver uh, to uh, get all the golds, I'll just. <clears throat> Uh, we can just go to uh, yeah, we can just go kick Kalaka's ass get the bad ending 
and then uh, yeah just a hmm, maybe I'll just record it maybe I'll just record the good ending and upload it to YouTube separately then but let's hope it doesn't come to that let's use your special moves to avoid the hazards and get to the finish okay actually all right now that I think about it, I think it said we need only a certain amount of medals or something. F 15 seconds, okay. They are wild! Oh. Oh. Wait. Oh, slippery. How are we. How are we supposed to get through here if we can't? We need to we need to fly here, but there's no surface to fly oh. on. Oh no! Do you want us to play on to that little ledge? Apparently. Uh, never mind. Can we get enough momentum off of that to even? Okay, that is the, the trick, I think. Okay, that. If there is a different thing that we need to do here, it is not being shown at all. Like, I know it makes sense with it being hell and all to not be easy in the absolute slightest. Right. Hmm. It, we 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 are missing something here. I feel like. Yeah, there. Okay. Fuck that one. Let's see. Defeat the enemies without the use of throws. Okay, that should be a lot easier. 180 or 130. 130. The throws are a lot more about crowd control than... It. There goes our combo. A lot more about crowd control than much else. Can we still recover from this? if it wasn't for the fact that you know, they they do the two planes thing here again yeah okay screw that one <laughs> and special move to navigate the portal room okay and oh we get gold just for finishing <laughs> I figured they were kind on this one since they figured out that okay, what? this is not a level you put the gold and silver on. Uppercut there, side there. 
And then we change the chicken at the end there. Okay. Can we even change the chicken notes midair? Or oh, I we need to we need to frog slam through that. Okay. Um, really? Wait, what? Okay. Wh what else could we do then in there? Or... Are we missing something? Here is that? Oh no, this is just for spacing things apart. Uh, yeah, I have no idea how we're supposed to get through that little gap there. Uh, find a way past the moving obstacles. Okay, one minute or thirty seconds. Yeah, I feel like we're probably gonna end up having to look up some of these. Okay, simple. We've done this trick since the very start of the game. Okay, that is less. Actually, Wait. is there a... Hell, th 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 yes. There's an easy way. Wait, what? Yeah, it is too small for chicken. Oh. Okay, it is possible to get past it. <laughs> Let's. Uh, oh, you hear rumbling in the distance. Okay. And there's that again. Okay. Hmm. It's ten copper, eight silver, four gold. Hello. Oh. Okay, so we need four gold to open up. Let's see, what's here? Oh wow, would you mind leaving that door open? The AC is busted, it's always <laughs> it has always been busted. What? What's with the calendar? Yeah, of course, it's a pinup, of course. And, yeah, well, but... it's hell, so demons. Uh, Smarsh? It's... Okay. Yeah, I know it was that, pinup that first, but then... The pinup was not what confused me. Co what confused me was the name. Let's see. Yeah, I know we really don't, uh, we don't really have to do El Diablo's work anymore. Honestly, you just kind of feel bad for the guy. At this point, I'm just writing stream of consciousness and waiting for someone to notice. A bird, a boat, a birth, bots, a heart, a starboard. This is pretty <laughs> actually pretty good stuff. Now that the tyrant Diablo is out of the picture, I have so much more time to type my manifestos. Someday these sheep around me will wake up too. No devils, no masters. You there, please help me. Can you tell me what my action items are? Wait, please, I just want to see <laughs> synergize one more time. It's been so long. That feels like a reference to something. Yeah. I guess I should be working, but I've been typing a picture of a house instead. Check it out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, that's a chimney? It's smoke. It's a chosen medium, okay? 
And we get 5,000. Okay. Okay, we need right. 8 silver and then 4... How many gold did we have? And there's still another layer above this. Let's see. 1, 1, 1, 3. I don't... Uh... I think the other ones we open once we have uh, enough silver. Yeah, because we already have four gold. They're, they open in order, probably. Probably expecting you to have to get silvers first. Okay, yeah. that means that we'll have to do these as well. Yeah, do, it, does, it does prove that you... That getting some bronze is fine. But that's how you open the first one. way to jump but since you've done some silvers it means the silver one will be easy quicker to open up there we go now get yes there we go and get a few seconds to spare uh, let's see this one was yeah just finish hmm. let's give this another shot and the game crashed. Okay, that's the second time or so, I think. Yeah. Uh, oh. Uh, did um, it save? That is the question. Yeah, I just realized that. Um, let's hope it did. Let's see. Yes, yes. Drink box. Studios. Guacamole! Super Turbo! Six twenty-three. Yep. Okay, it's safe. Oh, oh, oh wait, goodness. it it doesn't. It counts how many we have. Okay, and we need ten to open them. Okay. okay. So one more silver, five more gold. Okay, and and also, thank goodness that we walked past that damn thing. Each time, yeah. Or when we went down, let's see. Okay, just combo. Should be doable, 200. We've, we've hit 250 at one point. There's an achievement for that. No. They still recoverable. The specials give the most... Give the biggest boost to their combo. Okay, we'll have to restart that. I was not trying to do a goat fly there. Oh, dear gods. Timing. And it seems... Okay, we get, the we get the plus three for each one of them that we hit with that. Okay. Yeah, uh, I just realized we, we get a lot of coin from this. Let's see how much. Okay, we had about 2,000 before we got the big chest. Uh, let's actually check. I didn't actually keep an eye on it for any money or something. You, you are almost at 8,000. Yeah, but we got 5,000 from, uh, <clears throat> from the big chest. Oh. Then, yeah, then, yeah, yeah, then you still have a lot of money on this. Okay, salvageable still. Let's see, is there a costume that... There's the skeleton costume that gives us infinite uh, stamina. Too late. I don't know if we have enough silver to buy that costume. We probably do, but if we do, we can just spam the ultra you know, the super moves here. And just 
and I constantly like, get a massive combo from all of that. Yeah. I think that is a thing we may need to do. That we need basically we need to get ready to switch the damn uh, costumes about. Let's, see, let's upgrade that. Um, oh, break any shield with a single punch while active. Increases the speed up with the break. Okay. It, that's also heavy and okay. Uh, there we go. Infinite stamina, no life from red orbs. Uh, we we don't have enough silver for that. Okay. That is an annoyance, but. Oh well, that just means we'll have to get good. <laughs> Rately game. Okay. It did save, at least. Yeah. Don't know why it crashed there. I, I yeah. see a spike on the on my GPU. But beyond that, I, I have no idea. Let me move this up a bit, so I actually ha can look straight forward at the game instead of having to look down. Hmm. Okay, this is the one. Let's see. Hmm. Could try using Intenso here. Well, that might smash them too fast for us to actually get all of the combos out of them. Yeah, unless it somehow multiplies the combos? That got an even back. Fuck! On the plus side, you have Rookie Record. Let's see. Whatever you I just spam the moves here. Yeah, the, the red ones really are just combo breakers. Yeah. Yep, it's your new best at least. So, again, you did better. Okay. Let's give it a try with Intenso. Restart. If we get hit, we just restart. And I think yeah. I'm not sure. I think we just beat them a lot faster, which made it seem like we were probably doing better, whilst we were not. Okay, you're right. The, the Intensors were definitely good against the damn red ones here. We can't hit all of them quick enough to just all interrupt their attack, so we do have to just avoid getting hit. Fuck. 
Yeah, I give it you glacier boy, you oof. How did that miss them? I... Really? Oh, you, you got hit? No, the combo got stopped because I didn't hit anything quick enough. I, I saw a Chivo, uh, a white Chivo pop up at the top there. That signifies end of a combo. Oh. Okay, that is a bit harder. Yeah, 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 that dodge was too close. Oh. Mm. Okay, what I'm going to try to do is just punch two of them on one side. Speaking of the red you know, skeletons there. And then just throw one of them into the bunch at the other side. Back here, you. <laughs> okay. The moment that one appears in ten, so to just fuck him up instantly. Yep. Yeah. Oh, we got someone new in the chat. Hello. Oh, blood that. Sham Shucklebuck. I am yeah, already at Feel free. Feel free to give a tip if you think it'll help. Uh, no, you're freaking dumb, Greeny. Catch the dodge a bone there. There we go. Grab you immediately. Put you in the dirt. Okay, almost there. There we go. Uh, wait, I, I thought we had a com. <laughs> I thought we had an achievement for hitting 250 combos. Oh no, that was the gold edition, not this one. And we yeah. just hit, of course, it ends with a bone to the face. Okay. Uh, okay, with the amount of combo we got, I think it will, it will mean we probably could just lose your dude through the red ones. Okay. And, yep, yeah, welcome uh, welcome to the screen, Clara Shucklebuck. Yep. <laughs> Oh. And we're one short of silvers. Oh, okay, that that was annoying, but it could have been much worse. Like with the ones above, where we uh, can't dodge or anything like that. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Um, which are these again? The defeat without dodging. Let's see. Try and get 70 here. The one one thing I do notice that is a lot of help with building up the combo meter is just hit them or hit bunches of enemies with the special moves since it counts for all of them. Here we go. Cut you short. When you grapple, you are invincible when you use the non true moves from the grapple. Like the okay. shockwave, like spractize, like. Ooh, that was close. Deflect projectiles. 
Okay. Let's restart that. There was my own mistake there. Okay. That would have been so useful in the other room. Yeah. Then again, if we waited too long, the combo might have ended while we were still making a move. Okay, save the last green one to throw into one of the red ones. You freaking don't. And and this combo got reset. Okay. Let's see. Can you tell when you grapple, you're invincible. Okay. Thank you for the tip, Miss Clara. That's hope. That's hopefully going to be useful in beating a few of these other chambers. Okay. So I think we might be able to. Cheese this somewhat uh, by just <laughs> by just throwing a bunch of power moves at the starting enemies. And I can't close it together, you two. Here we go. Already twenty-two. Almost. One more. There we go. Okay. Um, on, on the dots, even. Yeah. These dodgy boys are probably as worse. If not worse, yeah, for not being able to dodge, then that the red jackasses. There we go. That's another gold for us. Okay, we need to turn one of the bronze into silver to get access to the next one. Let's see. Yeah. I'm pretty sure the only reason we got silver here was because I accidentally mistook one of the gears for a platform right at the freaking start. Bit of extra air time there. There we go. Ooh! Was second away. Let's see, this one was yeah. Defeat without special moves. The biggest problem here is going to be the freaking chuka, uh, chupacabras. Don't even try. Okay, let's grab you two quickly. All right, let's see. Quickly, crowd control. them in mid-air as they spawn. Okay. Bring you down to ground. Ah. <clears throat> Actually, let's skip that one for now because it's a pain in the neck. Yeah, and we have the uh, just the shoes between. Yeah. Also open up the shortcuts there. Uh, let's see, we didn't finish this one. Uh, to, 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 yeah, get to the finish. That one. Yeah. Nope. Would it be a good idea to get the a auto save between each of these? Uh, if it doesn't 
Actually, that skull in the corner, that means that it is saving at each one. Okay, that is good. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, this one was without throws. So if we just abuse our power moves as much as we can. And of course, someone messes with the door the moment I need to look uh, need to not look away. <laughs> Timing. And all right for Clara, it does. All right. Yeah, the Double same information. Where it's well with a with a challenge run, it would make sense to have it saved automatically after each one. Otherwise, well, you would piss people off a ton. Did I just accidentally attack during the transfer? I think so, but yeah, it would piss off people off a lot, especially if you have crash issues. Okay. Nope. And the combo got interrupted because I tried to do an attack whilst we were exhausted. Okay. That was my bad. I'll recharge a bit. Before you two can get up to any funny business. Okay, at least we got the silver that we needed. If we focus on the Chupacabras, we should be able to get 130 here. Oops, I forgot about these. Back. Just went to grab some chocolate. Okay. Yep. Cast the wrong way. Okay, just lay down the pain. Okay. That should have opened the second door. Oop. Yep, rumbling in the distance. Nice. What was this one again? So yeah, special moves to the Lift to navigate the portal room. And this one was just yeah, avoid the hazards and get to the finish. Oh yeah, this one again. I, I, I have uh, yeah, Clara. If you know how to how the hell we need to get across here, <laughs> I would greatly appreciate hearing it because I do not know other than. To try this. Oh. Yeah. yeah, but there is no way in hell that we can pass through that all of that in 15 seconds. Yep. No, that's the game didn't crash. It just became unselected. I do not know why that happens some every now and then. And with this one, I have no idea how to get through the narrow parts. Like, it's not a frog slam. They know. There. They know. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so the, the goat fly from the absolutely tiny little lip could have been... What, uh, hello. Oh, I thought we could interact with the water cooler. Okay, we will have to try that again then. For now, let's check this out. Oh, and we found <laughs> we found El Diablo's booze oh, collection. Polo Bomba. As it. <laughs> Let's see. If you weren't for Goat Climb at the end, you would have made it. Okay. I actually just got really lucky that we actually managed to reach the end there. And that explains what all of those purple blocks are for. And egg bombs. What? Um. 
Don't you tell have me to get, we have uh, to. get on the wall there. Is there any who is chicken, but I'm pretty sure we... Okay, so we can turn into the chicken in midair. Why wouldn't it... Uh, that's not the intended route. Uh, you mean that for what we're doing, what well, what I was trying up there? Yeah, I think it's what they mean. Like, I thought it was a wall you could have just climbed onto there, just flew over all the spikes. Okay, let's at least try this one at the moment. There, okay. Was I, was I hitting the wrong button then before or something? Yeah, it doesn't matter now what's happening. I think I think it might be a case of uh, you missed and accidentally hit a spike by um, pixel or something. Let's see. For the spike platform over the gap. Okay. Hmm. Let me take another peek up here. Because I'm pretty sure all of the walls here are slant. Oh, oh no. I I completely yeah, missed that bit. You. Okay. Let's see. Actually, that, that should make it a lot easier to get 10 gold medals since we have access to other places. Defeat these ultra-powerful enemies, one hit and you're dead. Okay. That's going to be a challenge. Oh. Okay, gotta crowd control them. And keep an eye out for when they are attacking. Try to be a. Actually, if I try to be conservative, then just more will spawn, I'm presuming. Or just stay away from the shadowy bunch. Actually. I think we are invulnerable whilst we're goat flying. Or at least mostly. Can't have been all frick. Okay, let's see. Jumping will cancel in your invisibility from the dodge. So walk, wait until you the spikes. Okay. Let's just let's just cheese this. <laughs> Can't touch this. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. It will make... Yeah. It will stop us from damaging the shielded ones, so... Uh, damn it. Okay, so we can't cheese this part. Familiar with, uh, yeah, I know Looney Tunes. I <laughs> grew up with it. Oh, you poor little thing. Let's see. Uh, you dodge right when you land on it, you roll up the side, and you have a moment where you can jump. Okay. Great. Okay, so much for being invulnerable during the goat fly. Deal with the first wave, like. Yeah. And I jump right into that. And let's see, dumping will cancel your invincibility from the dodge, so wait until you're off the spikes. Yeah, for the double jump. Okay, yeah. Definitely we'll give that a shot after we hopefully get to the end of this one.
putting more cheese on this than the world's biggest burrito. Oh dear. And, oh blood, hey, a lot of gold coin again. It would be, still be good to upgrade the heavy and all that. Right. How did I dodge that? Okay, that was my bad for jumping into it. So yeah, we basically have to wily coyote the spike platform. The O that actually takes stamina. Okay. Makes sense. Okay, so we'll just have to cheese it well less than that. Okay, maybe we shouldn't be dressed in black whilst there are no. Oh. Enemy is fully black enemies around. Yeah. To lose track of our character. Maybe we should change to the other. Uh, wait, what, what, what did the chicken costume do again? Uh, health regen, so no use really there. Let's see how he runs off a cliff, but gravity doesn't affect him for a second. The same thing with your jumping off a platform. Uh, you have a moment where you can normal jump after falling off, and it doesn't count as your double jump. Okay. Intenso Shield Breaker would be a good purchase for this. Uh, let's see, didn't I purchase that already, or... Let, uh, let's check it back. Uh, use punches, special moves, and throw to get the chicken to the exit. Dimension Shove will help you control its path. Okay. Oh, it, it turns into a dead bird. Oh, okay, it's it stays in place uh, while we're in the dead world. Okay. Here we go. Okay, this one is a bit interesting. A Libre of a... I don't think we have that one yet. Uh, yeah, we don't have the Ale Libre costume. Oop. Are you just bouncing around in there at random or are you... No, you're bouncing this direction. Okay, that's the chicken I rock cross at least. Helping it cross a very complicated road. So let's see, for Clara, Shaker One made me cry my first time getting gold. Okay. I feel like we should be concerned. Okay, it lightens on the platform there. Where did that send the bird? Okay, it didn't send it back. Uh, okay. Uh, I hope that wasn't like really hard for you. I think that I think that's a that's a, a reference to another game. I heard okay. the game and your pet. Can't say I've heard of that one. <laughs> it's an amazing first time. <laughs> yeah, it definitely was. Uh, let me say this. People misunderstood the can for what they want. Oh, what can my pet do? You give it tricks, you give it costume. At the end of the game, you put your pet into a can as K. 
can me. Yeah. It's one of the ghost games that really trolls you hard at the game, and many YouTubers have screamed at it. Yeah. I, I think Clara is uh, in shock about how well that went <laughs> with the chicken. <laughs> Uh, I wouldn't. Have, I wouldn't say that it was easy, but I. I was getting a. I was getting lucky with a bunch of throws there. Uh, which devil is your favorite? As in general, uh, media devil. Ah, Lucifer, welcome to my office. Sorry about the clutter in here. Work piles up when you're usurped and banished, hey. I've been so busy since I've been back, you know, checking in on the team, keeping that morale high. So your assistance reopening my elevator is appreciated. Good luck getting Kalaka out of your wall. I'm much too busy to assist, but there's something over there that may interest you. Wait, I thought we had to get more <laughs> medals for this, but nope. There's our sixth one. You don't really need the medals to open the damn doors. Yeah, I thought there was going to be another door where we had to get more. And yeah, as you can see, there's one piece missing. You feel lighter. Okay. It's oh oh, the bunch of devil portraits. Okay, and why why again is there a picture of a slice of watermelon? Yeah, let's yeah, take a little peek I here. That one. We have the current one. We have this one. <laughs> we have a devil cat. Uh, we have a smoker and we have corporate overlords devil. <laughs> and then just ye olde devil. I know the uh, chaos emerald. <laughs> I'd say it's this guy. Not just because he's in charge at the moment. Yeah, I had to agree. But the first one also seems rather imposing. Oh, whatever. Some people react to when you are a chicken. Does he react? You know, I feel inspired. I'm ready to lock myself up in here and take this paperwork on. They, to they totally have things in the controls downstairs. We even need chance to type right. <laughs> Ever heard of Hunt and Pack? <laughs> yep, yeah, me to talk again. Okay, he doesn't. He doesn't say things differently. Uh, uh right, yeah, this. <laughs> we can fly now. What the heck? Winner is you. <laughs> yeah, luckily, no winner, winner, chicken dinner. Otherwise, uh, actually, would he have been able? Would the devil have been able to kill us <laughs> if we you know, tried as a as a chicken? Okay, and Very there's... Very likely. <laughs> okay. Now that we have all abilities, we could go around to 100% the game, but we play mostly for story after all. So, uh, time to kick a bony ass. Uh, wait. Do we need a final piece? We get that somewhere around here. Ooh. This is it, buddy. I hope you're ready. Tada. May the gods look favorably on you today, Yuan. This is your chance to stop Kalaka and restore balance in the universe. Would be a bit more, well, <laughs> impressive if we weren't a chicken. Mark. <laughs> okay. Yeah, great altar. Looks familiar. Yep. yep. One. You have to get out of here. Kalaka will be back any moment. I wish things hadn't turned out this way. I wish we were back in Prey Blue Show. I still have no idea how to properly pronounce that on the first time each time. I guess we're going to miss the festival. I think we have bigger things on our minds. Maybe we could have... Not so... Ooh. Luchador, how nice of you to join us for the final ceremony. Hey, you ugly Charo, you've got me. Now let him go. Apparently, Charo is like a, a slur for old-fashioned. Oh! 
Ah, oh, Muffin, how sweet. Or not, maybe not as much a slur, but an insult. Or, uh, bit of a thin line sometimes. I knew you'd come around to the idea of us being together. After all, you are about to marry a god. I just hope your incessant yapping will be curtailed by the skeletonization process. Let him go. Why do you care so much about this one anyway? Wait. I see what's going on here. <clears throat> You're the agave farmer. <laughs> You're a luchador now? But I killed you. I definitely killed you. Not to worry. You'll have the great privilege of dying twice by my hand. I am Carlos Calaca, the greatest chavo that ever lived and died, but lives again. Okay, so it's not just a... Uh... <laughs> okay, Boomer, leave him alone, but... <laughs> oh, and don't worry. I'll make sure she witnesses your painful, painful death. Okay, here we go. Now show me how worthless you truly are, Agave boy. Mascara Confect... What? I don't even know what that underneath was supposed to mean. Ow! Yeah, wait. Is this the final boss fight? I presume it is. And... Okay, he's swapping dimensions. Hmm. Okay, we might need to switch costumes for this. He doesn't... Okay, he doesn't actually take that many hits, it seems. Ow. I see as he immediately pile drives me back into the ground. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we really can't take too many of his hits like this. Okay, I'll have to be real fast on on the dodge. Okay, that's undodgeable. The slam down that is. <laughs> I killed you. I definitely killed you. I got better, yeah. <laughs> we totally did. Now now we need to get better at dodging. Oh, dear gods. Yeah, we need to we need to just get out of the way when he comes down like that. This cannot be his, fin uh, his final form. Okay, still got a hit. <laughs> we might need to reload to swap out Ooh. to a normal costume. Yep. Yeah, and uh, maybe double shake so we haven't missed the final one somehow. Yeah, there. Yep. It says six out of six. Oh, so we we all set for the good ending then. Yep. There is a seven, but we are supposed to get that somewhere around here. Probably between, well, this fight and the next uh, phase. Oh, okay, He hits damn okay. hard. Wrong move. But well, he's the final boss. I have a Spanish book for crying out loud. Mm. Miss. Mm. Okay, that shockwave is going. Let's see. But you get an achievement for killing Kalaka in the devil costume at full health. Okay. Uh, we can give it a few more tries, but I can't promise to act I'll actually get him like this. Because we are definitely not managing to dodge 
get at full health unless we get enough hits on him to regenerate. Alright, okay, I found just... a word. The Charo, you mean? Yep. Oh! It's double mean, like, it can be used as an insult, but it also means someone who is dressed as him. Traditional okay. rider clothing of some kind here. Okay, we, we need to jump whenever he's airborne. Ow. There we go, yeah. Uh, let's see. Well, the achievement doesn't really care about this fight, as you said, second form. Okay. It's, it's those shock waves from his landing there that actually hurts. Okay. But it, the more it, it had apparently three choices. Apparently, if I if I understand this book right, I'm not going to trust it blindly. Is also a third turn for a traditional Mexican. Okay. Yes, it, I don't think Ow. it was very specific, it was a it rude or not, but this is book Yulido's translation. So we come to slangs, I don't think a regular Spanish book will be trusted. Yeah, miss. I kind of need to keep my eyes on the entire arena. Oh, he's speeding up. Okay. Yep. Damn it. There we go. First base. <sighs> Luchador. You were lucky I spent all my energy on the ritual. But you are too late, for the Black Sun arrives. Come, witness the merging of two worlds, and the beginning of my new world order. Okay, going to need to put in a flashing lights warning on that, I think. The power. I can feel it welling inside me. Oh, hello. Oh. Behold, I am Kalaka, god of the living and the dead. Now tremble on my rule. For the, I think that meant for the champion belt or something at the bottom there. Okay, let's hope his attacks are a bit more dodgeable. Oh, we are getting invulnerability from grabbing these. Yes, Sue. Are normal attacks even doing anything? Okay, they are hurting him. Bloody. Ow. His face looks like one of those random orc symbols. From the fantasy of 40k. Okay. Okay, we can't. Oh, we can't. No, it's just. Okay. Just shut up. Oh. Now, roll in that one. Okay, I need to figure out his patterns. Let's see. Fun fact, this form can be beat blindfolded? What? Uh, okay, that, that'd that be impressive. <laughs> Especially well, since these comets seem to be random. Well, technically, you're doing that uh, almost. You, you do have an eye, eye patch. One eye, so... He's going to spit. Blindfolded? 
<laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure I dodged the last one there on freaking accident. Oh, I'm gonna let you have uh, uh, the pleasure of reading what the uh, glacier was just wrote. Yep. Okay, he's going to be spitting. So unlike Eminem, he doesn't spit fire. <laughs> His bars are weak. And those are all up uh, out rap ra lines. Rap ooh, community words. And ah, I bet you don't get hit by the comments. Let's put out a bit of a Okay, yeah, they don't hurt us. Okay. So yeah. Yep. You can probably tell what moves he's going to do then based on the sounds that he makes. Yeah. That's... Okay, now I see it on the chat program on the, le uh, on the right side of my screen. Yeah. It's the long lost brother of Gork and Mork. <laughs> oh dear gods. And there, there was one of uh, Orc God. I think, I think they, I think they tried once or twice. I think their name were Dork and Zork. Yeah. Okay, come on, that one lasted a bit longer than it's spewed. Ow. Yeah, that definitely is his easiest move to dodge at the moment. He wasn't brutally cunning or commonly brutal, so he died. Yeah, there we go. I need to I need to overextend less during the attack, so how I can actually dodge when he goes to counterattack. Oh not DJ. Okay, been a bit since we saw him pull that one out, so I didn't know where to dodge there. Ow. Okay. Ow. Okay, how do we dodge that? By crouching or something? Can we even crouch? Or wait, chicken mode. We can do this. Uh, yep. I say as I walk into the bloody beam. <laughs> oh dear. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Straight going for the most annoying one. Actually. Let's see. From Clara, crouching or chicken? Yeah. All right. Confirmed. Okay. Thank you for the yep. tips, Pedro Clara. Yeah, they are. They are highly appreciated. Yep. Go. Okay. Almost full health again. No roast chicken this time. Wrong. <laughs> he he pulls back more for the big one. Ah, damn it. Okay. Let's see. Intention doesn't recharge after you die. Yeah. So it is a precious resource. Hmm. Probably 
we can probably get it just from uh, beating on his ass. Both wrong moves there. Oh no, oh. Sam has got nothing on you. <laughs> okay, we were too close for him there. I think with the first smack there, he we actually transformed into the chicken at the very moment that the attack out would have hit us normally. Okay, I need to see. What is this one? De defeat an enemy. De what? We, we did we did not defeat an enemy with that. <laughs> okay. What? But, that, yeah, we get to... I was too close there. What? That, that must have been a bug. Yeah. Maybe for destroying one of those comets or something. An accident. Right. That, that, that's a uh, Go Wrong one. He didn't pull back as much. Oh, damn it. Okay, he's going to breathe on us. Okay, that, hit, that attack only... Oh. Nope, it doesn't only hit the floor. Oop. It would be fun to kill him with the, with the chicken bomb, but uh, let's just <laughs> let's just try it like this for now. I'm not going. I'm not good enough at this game to try and style on him. Yeah, only better a bit not to. Actually, we we can use the chicken fly to try and dodge some of the attacks. Uh, uh, emphasis on try. Oh, we got intent, so wrong button. There we go. Maybe if we get there with enough health remaining to be a bit cocky. Okay, he's going to spit. Both way there. Making progress. We don't have regular health. You never upgraded health regen, did you? I'm pretty sure I did. almost missed that one. That probably would have been a kill. Okay, he's coming out real fast now for us to be able to punch this shield down. There we go. Okay. Nope. Go. Uh, let me check. Getting a few achievements at uh, all at once. Good ending. Defeat Kalaka in Devil Costume at full health. Kill enemy with Polo. No, no, no bomb. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have all of the health regen. 
or uh, those are health regens for who? Uh, health orbs, not from actually kicking it ass. Oh, this. Uh, I, I can say I hate this shield the most because it takes the most work to actually get through. Get any shields there. Okay. Oh, damn it. I'm... Yeah, white Run shield ahead. is the worst. I keep accidentally changing the chicken form instead of dodging because I only have one finger on the shoulders of the controller. the dancing derp derp to get a decent bit of distance from him each time. Just throw all the combos at him. Ow. Wait, what? That chicken pack breaks the white shield for the normal human combo. It, that actually makes sense since the that comes out a lot faster. Okay, spit. I like a rap battle win. Okay, get a bit of distance. I'll, I'll keep that in mind for Guacamelee 2, which I actually played and finished before I ever touched this game. There we go. If we just throw out a row of, oop, of combos at him and then just retreat instead of trying to overextend. Okay, what is your next? There. Getting there. Miss that one. Good. Yeah, better to try and dodge that uh, way than to accidentally change into chicken form. Good. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Boom oh, shaka kalaka and the devil wears revenge. <laughs> there we go. Oof. I, I was actually considering... Oop, and there's number seven. I was actually thinking about... Well, trying to get the last kill with the, <laughs> the chicken bomb. Uh. There we go. <laughs> no chaos come <I'm> ruled.
<laughs> Glacier Boy being a peanut generator down there. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. <laughs> Okay, yeah. If we hadn't gotten all seven pieces, uh, we would have been too late to save her. Well, she was dead. She she was dead as a nail. But, yeah, somehow the mask resurrected her. And, yeah. <laughs> Old goat guy. Uh, yeah, this is a fun game. And the second one is even more fun from what I remember of it. <laughs> yeah, the mask resurrected you. Uh, yeah, if in the bad ending, from what I well, got spoiled of it, yeah. Glocka killed you, he definitely killed you. <laughs> Chicken referee, what? <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, if I remember... I, what I read of this, uh, the bad ending. Oh. I'm working the fields together. <clears throat> uh, yeah, she would have been dead, and ba oh, it's uh, it's made in Canada. <laughs> but uh, yeah, if I remember correctly, uh, yeah. Oh, you can watch normal ending and extras. Okay, and we got that done. Uh, winner is you. <laughs> you have completed normal mode. Hard difficulty is now available. You also saved our president's daughter. You are a true hero. And we have, okay, an online rank. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Let's look over here. Yep. Uh, happy ending, happy credits. And, oh, okay, there's a bad version of the credits as well then. Uh... Let's take a look here, then, how this otherwise would have done, gone. Much less uplifting music. And without the mask's full power... She stays dead. Oh. Okay, I... Th I heard that in the normal ending... If, what, I read in the normal ending that the mask resurrects her, but yet one was going to be stuck in the world of dead. And hello, new background. Ooh. Okay. And with uh, 15 minutes left to spare. Let's actually take a look at the... Uh, okay, you are... You look a lot happier than you should be for this one. Uh, oh, I think this is the point. This is... Yeah, him after being in denial or something, I'm guessing. Like, there is very clearly someone missing in all of this. Yeah. Okay, I, 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 you don't typically see different kinds of uh, <clears throat> the different kinds of endings depending on uh, yeah. yeah. You still stop Kalaka, uh, Kalaka and everything. No, uh, oh, now he gets a yellow card instead of a red card. <laughs> hey, yeah, save the rules. Not uh, just not Lupita, who Kalaka definitely killed either way. And, yeah, with all of this, he has the mask still on. And, yeah, shrine for her. Okay. Oh, oh this is where we're... Oh. Okay, she, she waited for him in the world of the dead. That's where that skin yeah. comes from. And the mask vanishes. Okay, uh, not really a bad ending, but definitely a bittersweet one. Yeah, till death do us reunite. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Uh, what is this one? I don't... 
Oh, that... Okay, that's the... Uh... We can't actually... Okay, we can skip. Don't know which spe specifically. Alright. <clears throat> well, uh, that means that we're done with Guacamelee Super Turbo Champion Edition. And, yeah. <clears throat> it means that we'll be moving on to Guacamelee 2 next time we do one of our side quest streams. Actually, I should probably start putting that in the titles. Like, main quest, side quest, or... Hmm... I'll put it in the middle, about. It would be odd to read that at the start of a title. Uh, but yeah, thank you for your hints, Clara, uh, Clara Shabuck, uh, Shucklebuck. <clears throat> Pardon there. And, uh, yeah. Uh, let's see. Tip. Due to my current work, I'm working a rather well, chaotic schedule with streams. Like, uh, I have today off and no work tomorrow. And for the, a few more days, I'll be free. So, because I had night shifts before here, which would have messed with our original schedule of streaming, basically on the even days of, like, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and sometimes on Sunday. Uh, but yeah, because I couldn't stream on normal times for quite a while now with work, I just do double stream days whenever possible. And, well, if it, I don't burn myself out. So today yeah. is going to be one of those double streams, uh, yep. but <clears throat> uh, now that we're done with Guacamelee, that new side quest game is going to be Guacamelee 2, and Wait, our you? current main quest game is Tomb Raider Legends. We are currently on a sort of adventure block with, well, the first game we streamed of, the, of this quote-unquote stream block was Tomb Raider Anniversary, then Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine, and now we're on Tomb Raider Legends. After which we will do Indiana, yeah, Indiana Jones and the Emperor's Tomb. And then finish it off with Tomb Raider Underworld. But yeah. That second stream will be in about three hours-ish. Let's see. Yeah, five, eight. Yeah, about 8 p.m. locally here for me. And it's 10, you know, 10 to 5 here at the moment. So you're... You are, of course, very welcome to come join for that stream if you are interested, of course. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah. For now, let's get started on our usual ending, uh, ending ritual by moving on over here. And we are going to look for someone to raid. So, let's see. Open up the browser. Head to Twitch. I, actually, I don't head to Twitch all the time. It's just open all the time <laughs> on one of the many, many, many tabs on this. So then I'll just change the screen share on Discord to the browser. So Trakir can help pick. Uh, uh, then I, what's I'm the, still here. Uh, I'm <laughs> more the question of, did I put the sign back on you? Uh, yeah, there it is. Uh, yeah, this is my co-commentator, Drakir. <laughs> Hello. Okay, we have quite a few people who are online. Uh, let's see, oh, I did change the screen I, I share. See. Uh, I didn't know those scenes. Okay, change the screen share window to Twitch. Go live. There we go. Ah, now I can see. Let's see. We have... Okay, apparently there's a new game called Crime Boss with a very Chuck Norris-looking guy at the top. <clears throat> Anyways, we have I'm Nice, who is streaming Splatoon 3. Anyone else streaming that? No. The Lagstorm is streaming Minecraft. Avatar debut, I'm now a Minecraft streamer. Okay, uh, the place is muted, so we can take a peek at what mod pack or something they are streaming. Or is it just vanilla? Uh, looks vanilla at the moment. Personally, I prefer modded. Wait, yeah. <clears throat> okay, can you move your mouse a little bit? Okay, that's the avatar. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyways, then. <laughs> <laughs> Sour Walrus is streaming Dredge. Okay, I heard a bit about this game. Uh, yeah, it's basically oh, yeah. a Cthulhu fishing game. Yeah. Hmm. I've been pondering to watch it on YouTube when it's fully out. Yeah, I've seen that someone streamed a demo of it. I'm. It has me curious at the very, same, uh, at the very least. <clears throat> same. Uh, like, I may watch a bit, but from there I may actually see if I will recommend us to play it or not, in case it's uh, if there's a very good story. Yeah. 
And we, we, we generally stream more games more for the story. Like, we won't go, uh, like, <clears throat> like say, uh, Binding of Isaac, where we just go through the same game over and over and over and over again. That too much of something just start gets me worn out on something. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. Not, not to say that we only do story streams, but... Next up, we have Dogged Dogless McDog, who is streaming Tomb Raider level editor. It's, I'm guessing that means they are playing custom levels, because this doesn't look familiar to me. Uh, we have Edrim, who is streaming Final Fantasy XIV online. I'm thinking about re-upping my subscription to that game. Oh, that, those were some, that's some neat moves that he was pulling off there. Okay, this is definitely advanced stuff for Dogged. <laughs> And he streams mostly Tomb Raider stuff, so it's to be expected that he would know it well enough to do stuff like that. <clears throat> yeah, I'm, I'm thinking about re-upping my Final Fantasy XIV subscription at some point, uh, because some friends of mine have been playing that a lot recently. Now, moving on, we have Ruffer Raccoon with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Okay. We have WBPL76 with Final Fantasy IV. K9 is streaming Tiny Rogues. Okay, some sort of top-down shooter. Kiri Natsuyoko is streaming Hogs of War. With... Okay, but... Well... I... Either this uh... is an old game or it's an old-style retro-style <laughs> game. I can't say I recognize that at all. Who um, do I? Let's see. The Lazy General is also streaming Dredge. And the rest of the people are a bit higher than we typically... Or have a bit more viewers than we typically raid at the moment. Mm -hmm. uh, then again, I, I don't think we'll ever hit 100 viewers or anything like that. Or Not that I want to. Okay. Any uh, of those sound interesting? Either Lazy General or Sour Walrus. Let's see. How is Lazy doing? Hopefully not too lazy, of course. Yeah, let's see. Uh, we've been raiding them a few times recently, I think. So, let's go give Sour Walrus a visit. It's been a bit, I think. So, there we go. Copy the name. Head back to our place, slash raid. But before we start with that, with that of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Uh, thank you, Clara Shucklebuck. Uh, Cl uh, Clara Shucklebuck. <laughs> Where did I put the L-E? Where did I pull the L-E from? Thank you, Clara Shucklebuck, for your hints and chatting along. Uh, thank you for being here as well as always, Glacier Boy. Did, it's coming to a point where did, <laughs> you're almost every he, you're almost you are here almost every time we stream, and that is highly appreciated. Uh, even if you are maybe only here to harass Drakir. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, Glacier Boy is someone who Drakir knows. Uh, <clears throat> But uh, yeah, uh, don't think there was really many anyone else. Though of course there could be people watching without accounts and such. So thank you as well, well as always, and thank you, Drakir. You're welcome as always, my friend, and thank you everybody for being here. <laughs> and yeah, like I said, in about uh, three hours we'll have our second stream of the day with Tomb Raider Legend. But until then. We'll start this raid before I forget, because I will forget something. And yeah, until uh, next time, thank you all again for watching. And until then, have a nice day. And yeah, <laughs> I'm getting myself <laughs> confused now. Thank you all again, and until next time. Peace, everyone, and watch out for skeletons.